there welcome to show tips and the 22nd tutorial of cell programming and cell scripting today in this video i am going to do the description and give you the tutorial of for loop in cell scripting and cell programming i will do for loop for the printing of the one to n numbers and for the recursive case like doing the same thing many times until for loop exists and with the help of this i am going to print a pattern pattern printing you have done in the C in using for loop you have already know pattern printing is like the printing the triangle in the form of asterisk so let's get started so this is the main for loop and here you can see I have written but before going to do this I am going to give you the demonstration of ACQ command ACQ means for sequence so if you type ACQ 20 so it will print 1 to 20 with the starting number is 1 ending number 20 difference is 1 so the sequence command is kind of like this I am going to show you how the sequence command will work. So here you can say sequence mean when you are giving one argument that's defined as the last argument and the first and the increment is defined as the one and one by default. If you get two argument it will think the first and the last is defined by the user and the difference will be increment will be by default. Remember on this here it is the increment so and there is no decrement mentioned here so i equal to 1 i less than equal to n i plus plus will work here like c but i minus minus may not work here i am going to test but if you are going to give you the three arguments it will give the first argument as the first number then next is the increment last is the last number so let me do sequence of 5 to sorry 6 to 11 with the help of difference 2 so 6 plus 3 sorry I'm 19 19 not 20 so 6 will be the starting number 20 will be the ending number difference between the two sequences or two numbers will be 3 so here you can see 6 9 12 15 18 and 21 is not there that's why 18 is the last so if we are going to give you the 60 to 20 with the difference of minus 3 will it work yes decrement is also working 60 57 51 up to 21 so plus and the minus is all working here and uh, let me show another thing 62 2 into thousand with the third 3 into 3 will work but it is not working so increment and decrement will work and other thing is not going to work here so let's quickly go to the code what i have given so here in this code you can see the for i and i am getting giving the i as the argument here i in the, the format of the syntax is the for space the variable name space i n that's when for loop is starting and this sequence is kind of giving the how many times it will work so i have given the sequence 1 to 50 the difference of 2 so it will print just hello world and then the number of the i value i am just giving the how the i is increasing or decreasing to know this i have given the i value so let's quickly run this program so here it is the program is started hello world one three five seven there is two difference is two up to 49 so i have given the last term as 50 so in this way you can do anything in the echo whatever you write in the echo and to between do and done so it is like a while and until loop i have given the description in the previous video same thing is that your command will be between do and done and the for loop is going to start and you have don't give this symbol of the reverse quotation to use this as a number otherwise it will think it is going to print something so keep in that mind so next program i'm going to print the uh, pattern of the triangle so here it is the same thing so i am going to whatever pattern is that 
first line will be the one asterisk then next line will be the two asterisk and up to five line will be the five asterisk kind of triangle if you have done in c you have already know how the pattern looks like so this is a very simple and basic pattern so i is going to start i one to five so i one difference is one then end in five so middle one if you do not want to give it so do not give so remember one thing when you are going to give any kind of increment by only one you do not mention have to mention the increment and you also do not have to mention the first bit only the last five may be mentioned but for your better understanding i have given the three arguments so after for i is one to five do we will start for the first for loop then in the do another for loop we start j j is going to sequence one to i so i is one so that's why it's going to print one as i is two going to two as trees and to start from what so in this way it will not up to five it will up to i value so dollar i you have to write it the sequence and the reverse quotation is same as the previous program so again the do is starting remember this do is for main for loop of i it is do for inner for loop of j so it is going to print asterisk and then slash it slash is a escape character it will not go to the next line i have mentioned in my previous videos if you do not know about the escape characters just go in my previous videos and follow my tutorial so again this done is for the inner for loop and then this echo line very important i have not written anything in echo so it will just go to the next line after printing first line asterisk it will go to the next line because i have mentioned the escape characters that's why you have to mention this echo otherwise if you do not do the echo next asterisk all the asterisk will be printed in the single line so that's why i have given the echo and i have not written anything because if you are going to write the slash and for next line it will oh, only the first echo will always go to the next line then slash and go to the next line so there will find a one line gap between two so after here is cursor cursor will move directly to here middle line will be blank if you use echo slash n here so i have not written echo so echo is self next line remember in this cell programming if you write anywhere echo it will always do a next line so do not have to enter slash n then this done is for outer for loop n it is very simple program so let me run this program so here it is asterisk of triangle first line one single line two third line three fourth line four fifth line five you can do also fifth five fifth line first line only five four three two one so only the thing you have to do just reverse it and just print j and decrement it so minus one in this way you can do it so i'm giving it up to you, you can just check uh, various type of pattern if you've done in c you can do is easily in this cell program so i have given the basic first pattern here so i hope now you have understand the working principle of the for loop here in cell programming also as kept in tutorial if you found this video helpful hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to soundtis to get more videos on self programming thanks for watching this video hope to see you soon in my next video